the next question. The next question is how to handle the sexual energy. Diese Frage ist, um, wie man mit der sexuellen Energie umgeht. This is the most fundamental and basic thing to be remembered because we are born out of sex only. So, we are made up of sex. Every cell is made up of sex because we are made up of sex. They are not coming from the sky. From the mother's womb only we come. So, we need to know what to do about the sex. It is a very difficult thing, you see. It is easy to detach from money. It is easy to detach from the post and the power and property and all these things. Little bit easier. But to be detached from sex is little difficult. Because you are born with it. Money came later. So you think every baby carrying some euros when they are taking birth. <laughs> but certainly we carry sex. <laughs> this is so intimacy. There is an intimacy of sex and ourself. So the fragrance is always there from the birth owners. Now, we must understand, like the sleep, many people they do not know what we talked about the sleep. They think just, okay, work is over, I am going to sleep, I am, I am seeing the television, I am reading novels, enough. Sedation comes. It's a dizziness, not sleep. Sleep is different totally. Dizziness. No, after alcohol, no, a kind of sleep comes, no? That kind of sleep it is. You see? Same sex also. The society must know the deep knowledge about all these things. That's why I'm flying here and there to teach how to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I'm a trainer for sleeping. Funny thing, you know. <laughs> when I told someone, he was laughing at me. You were training for sleeping. What for? Everyone knows sleep. <laughs> I asked back, do you know sleep? Yeah, yeah, I know. Every day I am sleeping. Yes, animals also are sleeping every day. <laughs> Your sleep must be different than the animal sleep. That's why I am giving training. So, so the birth is a puzzle, the death is a puzzle, in between life, the sleep is a puzzle, sex is a puzzle, how many puzzles? You know puzzle? <laughs> Can you translate in German? Also es ist, die Geburt ist ein Rätsel und der Tod ist ein Rätsel und das Leben ist ein Rätsel und die Sexualität ist ein Rätsel. Es ist wie viele Rätsel gibt es denn? Puzzles mean some secret in it. Birth has got some secret. Death has got some secret. Sleep has got some secret. Sex has got some secret. One must know the secret. There is no point in hiding all these things. That's why I am not hiding all these things and talking openly. It is a great blunder if one hides the secrets. If you know it, you have to tell it. I know very well our brothers and sisters in the world are suffering because of these problems only. 
You know what are the problem? They don't know the secret of birth. They don't know the secret of death. They don't know the secret of sleep. They don't know the secret of sex. These four problems in the world, nothing else. Give the result to them. There must be a sleeping university. There must be a birth university. There must be a death university. There must be a sex university. These things should be cleared off to the people. What's the secret behind it? Why God has created all these four important things? These are the four important things. Our office work is secondary importance. Money making is tertiary importance. Entertainment is the last important. Forgetting all these important things, we are going for entertainment, you know. Foolish idea. <laughs> I have been telling that you are the entertainment. There is no better entertainment than you. Forgetting yourself, you are searching for entertainment. For a little pleasure here. Little joy here and there. Clubs, going to the clubs. Huh? But their business will be out. Once once this is revealed, their business will be going off. That is for sure. There will not be much business of entertainment in the world. If the person is totally clarified about what is the secret of birth, secret of death, secret of sleep, secret of sex. I am revealing the truth. Wherever I am moving, I am an atom bomb. Swamiji, yeah. sometimes they call me Guruji. Swamiji, we have no time to meditate. I heard that you are giving many meditation techniques. I, I heard from my friends and other people, but I have no time. I asked back only one thing. Do you see, do you, do you do sex? Yes, Swamiji. <laughs> because talking about sex is very bad in India. <laughs> yes, Swamiji, I am doing sex. <laughs> Why you are so much shy on this? <laughs> you are made up of sex. I am also made up of sex. Everybody is made up of sex. The tree is also made up of sex. Animals are made up of sex. Birds are made up of sex. God himself is sex. Ying yang. <laughs> Everything is sex only. Why do you hesitate to talk about the subject? Yes, Samaji, yes. What, what you are trying to say? <laughs> Make, understand what is sex. That is meditation for you. That's all. You don't have to waste time separately for closing eyes and doing Bhairava, etc. Forget about Bhairava. It's not for you. Understand what is sex. Make your partner also to understand what is sex. What is the energy? It's one kind of energy. That's all. It's a Muladhar energy. Ganesha. Lord Ganesha energy. Make it into Shiva. Yesterday you, you experienced it suddenly. Om Namah Sivaya. What is this? You rise to a sex energy to Shiva energy. I didn't tell yesterday. <laughs> That's why you are so joyous at the end of it. Because your sex has moved here. Without your permission, I moved your sex there. <laughs> See the funny thing? It's an energy, that's all. Now, again, it is a very big subject. I used to take at least one day retreat for the whole process of sex energy alone. 
There are many things involved. At Manambi, there are 10 minutes left. That's why. <laughs> exactly. I want to close this subject now. We have to go for bliss initiation. Yes. Now, I want to tell you very precise way, precise way, what to do about the sexual energy is that once the sexual energy is coming and it reflects in your body, you are stimulated for sex, you just approach it to higher level. Don't try to keep it in the lower level. Sex energy, there is a possibility of raising the energy into higher level. There are two possibilities in sex. One is either you can waste your energy through lower way or you can raise energy to your sastra. Two options are there. Wise people will raise it. Idiots will lower it. That's all about it. So, approach the sexual energy like a yogi. Be a yogi there and transform that energy. It is like a unripened fruit. You can make it ripen. That's all. It is your responsibility. You have to work on it. It won't happen just like that. Because millions and millions of births, we use the sex in many births. We use it in a very misusable way. We misuse the sex. This time, this birth, at least, you must know how to use it. That's the difference of this birth. Forget about the past. Forget about up to yesterday. From today onwards, you know how to rise the sex energy to higher level. For that, you have to do only one thing. When the sex, are, whether they are partners or there, or single, doesn't matter. The formula remains same. When the sex energy is there, I'm telling about for partners now. When the partners are there, the sexual act is going on, just avoid fantasies. No fantasy. Cut it. Do you know what is fantasy? This is a great meditation. In meditation also you are cutting the thoughts, cutting the imagination. Here you are cutting the fantasies. That is the enemy there. <laughs> the fantasy is pulling your sexual energy downward. Asuras, they are all. They are not devas. Point number one. Point number two, avoid this earth attraction, gravitational pull. Avoid the gravitational pull. Use such a bed or a standing posture is, is recommended. There you are away from the gravitational implication of the earth. And watch your breathing. Breathing is very important in this meditation. If you are suffering from cold, never interfere with the sexual act. Please avoid. Also, the atmosphere is very important. 
und die Atmung ist wichtig in der Meditation. Und wenn ihr eine Erkältung habt, dann äh, soll man nicht in die partnerschaftliche Sexualität gehen. You are supposed to participate in the sexual act after two hours of eating. Also zwei Stunden nach dem Essen. Minimum. And also the intestine has to be cleared. Also zwei, zwei Stunden nach dem Essen und äh, man sollte sich entleert haben. And also you are not supposed to be tired. Das auch nicht müde sein dabei. Very important. <laughs> See, whatever I am saying now, opposite is happening in the world. Please remember, this is where the problem is going on. You follow Kumbhaka in the Pranayam, there is a stage called Kumbhaka. You know what is Kumbhaka? There is inspiration, expression. In between two things are there. That is Kumbhaka. You inspire and there is a holding. And you are expiring the breath, there is a holding. The two holding is called Kumbhaka. Also, what we do with the Atmung is the Atmung to hold for the moment between the Einatmung and the Ausatmung. Okay. Follow Kumbhaka. Try to be in Kumbhaka. Try to be in stop of breath for more time. It's very important. Especially when the partners are active in the sexual act, you are supposed to be in Kumbhaka. When you stop, you breathe. The formula, you see? When the act is there, stop the breathing. When the act is not there, breathe. Inyam. Very important. It's a yoga. There is called Pariyanga Yoga. There is a yoga for it. Pariyanga Yoga. Nobody is speaking, first of all. <laughs> they are afraid of speaking about Pariyanga. Also, vor allem in den, uh, den Atem in der Aktion zu halten. Sie? Sie? Ich habe gesagt, ich habe gesagt, wie das ist. Das ist Aber eine Sache ist sicher. You will forget about this if you follow all these things. Yeah. Nobody will be interested in sex at all. <laughs> that is what you are. That much conditioning is going on. Come to condition number one, no fantasies. <laughs> condition number two, the breathing should be fine. Now people are difficult to breathe in here. How you will enter into sex? When you don't know how to breathe, how you know how to make sex? <laughs> It's a funny game. <laughs> exactly opposite is happening in the society. I have no time, otherwise this subject I can explain like anything. <laughs> you see? Opposite the society. That's why you don't bother about society. Society will not help you much. Forget about it. <laughs> For the society has not taught about the secret of birth, the secret of death, the secret of sleep, the secret of sex also. They have not taught you. Why you must be grateful to this nonsense? <laughs> I'm sorry. Sometimes I'm talking like this. Nonsense and other things. Yes? Hello? I have. <laughs> Please be seated. Interesting subject is going on. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so many preparations are there, like a yogi. Both husband and wife, partner should be like a yogi. And then, at the time of the sexual act, I told you, hold the breathing, Kumbhaka, be in the Kumbhaka when the act is going on, action is going on, sexual action is going on. 
and then focus on your Brahmarandra. Focus on the Brahmarandra. Finish. <laughs> totally finished. Focus on this crown chakra, Brahmarantra. That's all. Of course. Don't you have the regret that you missed all these kind of things? See, one need not to worry about all this. Simplify life. Simplify life. Simplify life. Aradhana, very Saradhana. Please, please, Aradhana is wanted urgently. Please call. She is letting people in, uh, no. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 it's okay. <laughs> so, this much is enough now, since you asked the question about the sex. <laughs> if I talk more, uh, people will forget about sex. If another fighter speaks, then will no one ever talk about sex. Because it is such a difficult yoga. <laughs> It's not an easy thing, you know. It's the most difficult, most difficult thing. Okay. Checklist. Okay, come on, you are eligible now. We are all partners today. If no point is there, please get out. I am a yogi. Check this. <laughs> Paste it on the door. <laughs> Check the list and come in. Otherwise, you should get out. <laughs> really, really, the ideal couple program is very beautiful program. <laughs> you missed it in Vienna. Probably next time when I come, <laughs> I will have this ideal couple program. <laughs> Many customers. Das ist das ideale Partnerschaftsprogramm. Es ist ein wirklich schönes Programm. Man kann es eben jetzt dieses Mal nicht machen in Wien, aber es ist ein wirklich ein sehr schönes Programm. So, ideal couple program starts with how to select a partner in multiple aspects. Whether he or she is a real partner for me or not, you have to scan it. And then you become a partner. Oh, you should... No, you can always tell your son or daughter or granddaughter. Grand. <laughs> Even now it is not too late for your family, maybe late for you. <laughs> Don't regret for it. Anyway, you are already enlightened. <laughs> You see, <laughs> all these conditions looks very hard, but it is for enlightenment, please believe me. Yeah. One can be enlightened during the sexual act. This is the truth. <laughs> Once sex is not appearing, forget about it. Use uh, Bhairava. <laughs> Those who, those who don't have the opportunity of sex, don't worry, do by <laughs> If you feel it is very difficult to do by do three meditation. <laughs> okay? Other time.
I miss six five. Time off suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So these are the things. Probably whatever you learned, the wisdom and the knowledge about your life and you, please practice. Om Shanti Shanti